Stephen Stump from Twitch.com saying when it comes down to those last couple of restarts, there's only there's only so much track, there's so, so many cars in front. Um, how much was it kind of trying to go where everyone wasn't? Were you kind of feeling boxed in depending on where everyone was and had things gone a little bit differently in terms of where everyone was, do you think? It would have yeah, been a different result. Those those restarts are obviously very hectic. It's probably the most hectic uh, on the schedule other than like Pocono or something like that. And um, it feels like you're boxed in very much so, but you almost kind of just bring that intensity level where I'm just taking this track position and you can get out of the way. Like being a champ four car, you almost just have to bully everyone else and take what you can. And uh, those last couple of restarts I took as much as I could and it's just like, you can only take so much when you're in that spot. And we were in a tough spot, obviously. Second in line bottom was probably the worst spot to be in uh, uh, overall. And still to finish in the top five and uh, get third in the champ four, it, it feels good. But yeah, the intensity is always high and I always usually suck on restarts. And my restarts were actually positive today. So that's something that I look forward to going into next year, uh, going into everything. And then obviously the champ four and, championship race obviously i hope i'm in it um but it gets me excited for that and then obviously in the second half of the year you scored your first win you scored four more or you scored three more you won your first oval you made the championship four obviously it's not the result that you guys wanted today but can, can you kind of describe the second half of your season kind of put into words what you guys have been able to accomplish with the one team yeah i mean we figured it out like i figured it out i guess i mean like even the cars last year I drove with JRM, like they were always really good. I just always was kind of like the weak link. And it was not in a bad way, just to where I was still learning and developing. And um, these cars are hard to drive. And uh, I finally figured it out, got that first win and the floodgates kind of just opened. I always told myself that, like that was gonna happen. And um, to have it actually happen feels really good because I was almost like just gaslighting myself till it happened. Um, but. Yeah, it, feel, it feels good to finally get that going, and uh, obviously to make the Champ 4 in, in general is huge. Like, that's a feat in itself, so I'm happy to be here. Like, I put a smile on my face all week because you only have one first time here in the Champ 4, so I'm looking forward to having another one and doing even better. Thank you. This is Austin Dillon, driver of the Bass Pro Shop Chevrolet. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also check out one of those two videos beside me. Visit frontstretch.com for more racing content.